Hey guys, Mr. 224 here uh, with a tutorial on how to install too many items and build craft for your Mac on Minecraft 1.1. So, uh, let's get started. First thing you want to do, you're going to want to go on your internet and uh, go to all the links that I have in the description. First thing you want to do is go to the build craft site and download these five things. Client A core, client B transport, B factory, etc, etc. This is for multiplayer, ignore that. So you want to get these. Uh, each one will take you to an Adfly uh, website, so I suggest you right-click and go open link a new tab for each one so that you don't lose the page. Next, you want to download too many items from here. So the link will be here, Marglyph too many items. Go down and download from Minecraft 1.1. Then you want to go, you need Minecraft Forge. So I just that, like that. Minecraft Forge. Here's a website, you scroll down and for Minecraft 1.1 only. Uh wow, fail. Next, Rizagami's mod. You want to go on mod loader. It will take you to this page. Rizagami's uh mods, everything updated, whatever. So you go down and mod loader 1.1. The rest just ignore. Next, you need that. You need mod loader uh MP. Now this is going to take you to the uh, planes mod and uh, World War II guns. Ignore all that. Just go down, down, and right here you're going to want to go to mod loader MP client. Make sure to download client and not server. So now that you got all this, I got this all set up. Minecraft Forge mod loader and mod loader MP are what you're going to need to run the mod. The build craft is the actual mod, and this is just too many items. So you want to go into Finder and go to your Minecraft folder. To do this, you go to your name. You go to the library, Oops. application support, and you find Minecraft. I highlighted it, which really helps, so go to Minecraft. Now you got all this. See, I already installed the mod, but uh, we're just going to delete it all. So you delete everything, and you run Minecraft. Pretty simple. Okay, so now you want to just put in your name. And log in. So there, now everything should have uh, come, all these uh, files. Now first thing you want to do is go into bin. Now you got minecraft.jar. Take minecraft.jar, you right click it, and you go open with archive utility 10.6. Now you get a folder called minecraft. Now here, you just want to click enter on it so that you can rename it, and go right before the dot and put backup. I do this because you could delete it, but what I do is if this gets screwed up or something, I can just delete this and redo it, take out the backup and redo this archiving. So uh, this is clean, this will, will be modifying. So now you want to do the same thing, but go to the end, dot jar, enter, and you click add. Now that you got this, you got a Minecraft jar. This is what Minecraft's going to read now. So you open this and you have all these AA classes. First thing you want to do is go to this gear at the top here and go to arrange by kind. Now this will show you all the folders at the top, it's way easier than scrolling down. Meta inf, you want to delete this, this is what prevents mods on Minecraft. Now the rest is pretty easy, so uh, you want to go on Minecraft Forge, Apple, uh, sorry, Command A to select all, and I like to copy because uh, just in case something happens I can re-download the mod without having to re-download it. Uh, wow without having to go on the website and downloading Minecraft Forge itself. So, Apple C, or Command, go into Minecraft.jar, and just please paste it. Apply to all. This will modify all the classes so that it lets you uh, have a mod in. Mod Loader MP, same thing. All mods are pretty simple. You just gotta learn which folder to put everything in. Mod Loader, same thing. Apply to all. Place. Now, too many items, same thing. Now you just want to select all, copy that, put that in here, paste, and replace. Now we're done with that. Now, what a lot of people think is buildcraft, you have to put them in here, which you really don't. Uh, so uh, now you want to go back to your Minecraft folder, where you have your bin and your resources, and you want a new folder, mods with an S. Now, the mods folder, you take it, and you just... Take all of those and drag them in. You're just gonna copy them, just in case. Wow. 
So now that you got that, you want to run Minecraft. For safe, you should run Minecraft right after you put in mod loader and things, just to make sure everything's up to date with your Minecraft. If it doesn't crash, then your everything's good. So let's just create a new world here. Call it build craft. Super flat. I just put it flat so that it generates way faster and doesn't have anything to actually generate. So let me just. Uh, do all these things to prevent any lag. I like putting on normal uh, controls. What? Now I have too many items, and you should have all these things: the mining well, all this stuff. What just happened to this guy? So yeah. So uh, too many items. Mod loader on. If it says off, then you missed. Uh, then you. Uh, didn't wow didn't download mod loader in uh, like well so uh that's your problem if it's still not working and you're getting a black screen um you're probably doing the installation right and just restart the video and try to like go step by step on each step wow so uh, yeah you should get all this stuff this is the minecraft 1.1 version so uh yeah thanks for watching uh, like comment subscribe